talk about the new One Piece chapter 1046 and obviously I want to start with the final chapter because I think the final chapter is uh, was the best and if, yeah so what we see here is that Monk Luffy is in the air uh, grabbing a, a, a lightning rod a big lightning prepared to throw it against Kaido and we see that Kaido looked like he accepts his defeat his, 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 the smile he gives is like this is the end uh, I have been the emperor I have done my work and now it's time to go die and so the interesting thing here is with Nika the, that devil fruit is that they say that it's the sun devil fruit but what I'm wondering here more more right now is if Nika is just a guard over happiness, but it's not guard of the sun, but the guard that gives the smiles to people's faces is that he's not the sun. He's not the sun guard, but he's more the guard of liberation and and freedom. And some way he can also grab lightning. Um, yeah. And the other, the other part that I really like with this new chapter is when Jinbei uh, takes a big uh, control, a big flow of water to try to uh, put down all the fires. Uh, after have, he have meet uh, talk with Raizo and Raizo do some kind of need, some kind of uh, technique from his devil fruit. I don't know exactly what kind of uh, devil fruit Raizo use. Um, yeah, and then we obviously have U uh, Usopp and Usopp starts uh, screaming at some kind of uh, uh, person that have a. Um, well, I don't know the right name for it right now. Was I say that the person using some kind of giraffe, fake devil fruit, so it's half human, half giraffe. Uh, that you know, the, well, the kind of fake that Caesar Clown makes, like far way back, in some chapters, far way back, like the not real devil fruit, but the only half of your body, like your your, you have body is horse or like you have hand is like a. Like claws of a bear, or or or, or, or that, something like that. Um, personally, I much more prefer the chapter before this one. Obviously, I think that chapter was much more, more interesting. Uh, obviously, it's with that was the fight with. Uh, in the beginning of the chapter, you see the fight with the Monkey Luffy and Kaido, and Monkey Luffy used different attacks. And we see that Kaido start to, in some, uh, start to feel that he's he gonna lose, obviously. But I, I think the best thing for Kaido is that Kaido always want to die, and Kaido the best thing and Kaido always want to die against somebody that is have defeat him in a fight in an honest way. So I think that when we see the kind of smile of Kaido. When he see that Monk Luffy is in the air grabbing the light lightning to prepare to fool against him, I think that there's some kind of happiness that he understands that finally he can die. He finally uh, he he will accept his death of a great warrior. And I think for many many for many people for many culture uh, around the world, I think for, uh, to die in war. Um, it's an honor uh, for some culture uh, in history, and I think for for like for me, like people like for us, like people that li not uh, grown up in that kind of culture, we not understand this. We we will we not gonna know because we have not grown up with like the Sulu, the samurai, the Vikings, the Rajputs. So we are not, we not know really their culture. We just we can read of them about them in the books, but we don't really know the full pure contest, com pure things of that um, of that culture. Um, so I think this is, is um, 
I mean, I, I, when you read that part of the, the, the chapter, you feel like that. It's like a, a, a warrior legend. Uh, he's, he's the end of his defeat. I think that he always wants, like that, that is the thing here is that the only reason why Kylo wants to start a big war is not to conquer anything, it's just to, to die in war. That is the whole mission with Kaido, that he was want to find the strongest opponent. Like that's also a reason for why Kaido uh want to attack Marine Fort when White Bear was there to f to fight in a big war and maybe uh, and really want to fight against White Bear. It's not because he want to have power, he want to f have a big war, die in a big war. Um, yeah, so he's, uh, in some way, obviously, Kaido is very much against the Samurais, but in other way, I should say, maybe people will disagree here with me, but in some way, I think Kaido is the most Samurai of all of the Samurais, in, in, uh, because he's, he's, the whole purpose is to die in war, um, to... Find he find his uh, warrior uh, power to yeah find a place in some way. Um. Yeah, so I think that is was very interesting. Um. And uh, so this is some obviously this is a very good chapter. Obviously, obviously this is we talk about One Piece here. It's like One Piece. Maybe you're gonna fight. Five or five, maybe five boring things, and the rest of them is maybe twelve good things. Um, yeah. So I really, really hope soon that we're gonna get Kaido's backstory because I have so long time wait want to see that for so long time, like all the way, like maybe like one year ago, uh, to want to see Kaido's backstory. Um, so for me, the, yeah, I really want to see that. And obviously, the f um, the, in every chapter in One Piece, uh, they also have a, a, a back uh, a story before the before the, the whole chapter, and we see two shadows in Hokkaido Island. And my prediction here is that these two characters is is two members. I don't know who they are. I think there are two members from the Blackbeard Pirates, and I think maybe Blackbeard is right next. I think going to be always a two part. We're going to see soon Blackbeard, and the Blackbeard Pirates are going to be in Hokkaido Island. And why I think they are in Hokkaido Island? Oh, with the devil fruit, they want big ones devil fruit. Uh, and the second thing is nobody, nobody is there to protect them. Because Big One is really weakened. Katakuri do not stand a chance against a combined force or against the Blackbird Pirates. Uh, and yeah, that, that, that should also be really cool to see the Blackbird Pirates in Hawke Island because they are like, obviously, is um, the differences with bad uh, evil characters. I, like Big Mom is evil in some way, but in comparison to Blackbeard, she's not. You understand what I mean? This like Big Mom just want to have an empire of different people, different groups of people. Uh, so she just her, her her mission was never to be an evil tyrant, but that just happened. Um, Blackbeard is opposite. Blackbeard, he wants to be the tyrant. Like, this is what I mean. Blackbeard is evil because he's he, he because of his crew too. Because if a captain shoots a crew that belong to, a, for example, a serial killer, uh, a, a extremely violent alcoholist that drinks violence to kill people, um, and to have a person inspired of it, like a, a Nazi, uh, Shiri of the Rain. So, I mean, this is what I mean with Black, Black Papyrus. 
every member of the Black Pirate is symbolizing something very cruel. Like for example, Lafitte, like he's an inspiration of Alex from uh, Clockwork Orange. Uh, he is a, he's a extremely violent police officer, and he was so violent as a police officer that he was fired from his work. Then you understand how violent he is. If he is okay, if he is a police officer and he is fired from his work because he is violent, then you then yeah you yeah you understand what I mean there, how violent that person is. Um. So. Yeah. So the whole co core of Blackbeard's symbol symbolizing, he's symbolizing everything that is negative and and bad in the world. Um, Big Mom do not Big Mom don't really symbolize that thing. So this is what I mean when if Blackbeard Pirate is gonna come is on the whole cake island, uh, it's gonna be very I think I think that's something that's gonna be really, really cool to see Katakuri fight against who I don't want to see Kajikuri fight against everybody at the same time. I want, I'm, okay, I say, I mean, I say that Katakuri against, uh, just for example, uh, Vasco de Shot, for example. I, it, it's not gonna be, it's not maybe a good matchup, but just for example. Um, because I want to see the character that we have not seen so much of in their fight. Uh, and I want to see a fight that is very different uh, uh, because Monk Luffy, when he fights against Katakuri, they have, their devil fruit movement in that that time um, was a bit similar or uh, and different. Also, I want to see something that is very very opposite each other. Uh, and I think Kat I think Katakuri and Vasco the Shot is very very different from each other. I do I absolutely do not believe that. Vasco the shot gonna take category devil fruit because I already I already say where I think Vasco shot half a devil fruit. Um yeah, uh, so the whole chapter was interesting things. Uh, Nami and uh, Chopper was there. Uh, we, the only the um the free person we don't see from the story of pirates in in this chapter was uh, Nico Robin. Soro and Sanji was not in the chap this chapter. Um, yeah, so obviously it's gonna be it's a break. Uh, it's a break uh, next week, so it's no one piece chapter next Friday, but after that is a new gonna be a, a new chapter, and I think it, this is just a pure prediction. That chapter one thousand forty seven will be the beginning of Kaido's backstory. It's just a pure prediction. Okay.